What the actual hell? It is so heavy though. <laughs> it is so heavy. Oh my god, I'm already dying. Initiating. Welcome back to my daily grind. Create yourself is what you'll find me doing every day and every night. No time to lose. One day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome back to the vlog. It is Monday, the another day, another chance to push hard. And the topic for this vlog is finally assembling my $5,500 vlogging rig. So let's get it. By the way, all the equipment vlogs right here, watch them all. But before we get started, love goes out to all my subscribers. Thank you for making my life special and worth living to the max. So let me try to fake with a sweet, sweet video. Now, here we go. Finally, after all this talking, let's finally get to some action in this vlog. I will, as I said, I want to assemble the ultimate vlogging rig the ultimate setup like when I think about it it's insane it's so expensive and it's so heavy I'm not even sure if I will be able to like sustain the vlog with a with such a crazy setup and there is a risk in that an inherent risk because if I ever drop it or if it gets stolen or for some reason this <laughs> setup is way too expensive I mean there is always a risk I guess no risk no fun it's just like a super expensive car if you crash it then you're basically screwed so let's forget about this risk that's stupid I will just try my best to not drop it like Steven in this vlog he dropped his a7 III and it was yeah. oh, no I will definitely stay on the safe side with this setup <laughs> <laughs> so as you can see, I still haven't touched this scenery. Oh god, it's looking so good. But now it is time. So the plan is to put the Betis onto the Sony, mount the road, video mic, Pro Plus on this thing, insert the cards and all of that needs to go on the gimbal. And I also somehow want to mount this monitor on the gimbal as well. So let's get right to it. The parrot is in the way right now, so let's put it aside. If you're interested in this thing and maybe check out the unboxing or or the equipment playlist i guess got myself the extended kit when i think about all the possibilities that i have now this is mind-blowing yo i'm so stoked for the new vlog like for the future and for for everything basically i have oh my god this, that's the sony right there this is actually the first close look that i'm that i'm taking of this thing this is all so new to me this is amazing okay first of all let's insert the battery pretty much no brainer right there secondly let's put on the lens i think so let me just <laughs> that's my new weapon of choice right there isn't that amazing okay also oh snaps open like that let's insert the cards 64 gigs v30 one and two let's go this is so cool and let's try to screw on the video mic pro plus i'm not entirely sure if i will keep the mic on the on the camera or if i will put it on the gimbal it's probably the best to have it on the camera but we will see battery <laughs> where the heck oh seems like i'm a bit too stupid for this how, why I just why can't I this is obviously the right way But I just oh oh my god. I didn't expect that I have to use so much force uh. Okay, so that's on there. That's the new that's the new vlogging setup without all the fancy stuff Let's take a look at this screen right here. Is it really that useless? Oh, yeah, absolutely You can't even tuck it away anyways So this thing is just like hanging off here or what maybe you can remove this thing because this that's just stupid but for now i will just leave it as it is i guess next up let's mount it on the release plate of the gimbal i'm not sure if i will need the riser for that oh my god barely i will get away without using the riser this is amazing super tight tolerances right here but it does work out without the riser which is super amazing in my opinion plus throwing s <laughs> That's my approach right there, for now. Mm. Oh yeah, for sure good enough. <gasps> Whoa, this is awesome. Let's actually move this, this base plate right there all the way up here. And now it will allow me to slide it a bit further to increase the clearance even more. Perfect. And lastly, yes, pretty. 
well balanced on the Ronin S. Absolutely insane. It is so heavy though. <laughs> Should I just turn it on? Okay, never mind. It came with an empty battery, but I just found out that you can actually charge it with this funny power brick right there. The only thing is that this cable is fairly short. This is just looking so fragile. But other than that, let's give it a try. <laughs> Yo, this is crazy. <laughs> let's actually try the monitor. Whoa. Why is it so small though? I want to move it on this table, but I think I can. Another problem will be the monitor placement, but I think I found a solution for that. And the solution will be at this thing right here. As you can see on the other side, there is a Ronin S focus wheel. And on this side, there is nothing. I just removed this cover plate right here and it revealed two M4 threads and I will actually switch sides for this thing because the monitor needs to go here because there is only a thread on this side There is no thread on this side probably can't use it like this that would be cool But nope it needs to go on like this and I probably also need to you know invent something as you can see I just switched sides I don't have a use for this thing So I might remove it all together But for now I will just leave it on the on the right side and on this side I have to invent something for the, for the monitor, but that's a quest for another day. But for now, I just need to resort to something else. I need to resort to this bracket. Okay, so that's just crazy, but at least this will give me the opportunity to actually finish this vlog because there is no chance that I will be able to come up with something today. What the actual hell? The problem is I can't really balance this thing, but the Ronin should be powerful enough to handle it. It's not super unbalanced, but it, it's kind of unbalanced. Oh my God, I'm already dying. Oh God, this thing is heavy. Oh, there is just no way that I will be able to. Oh God, this is so heavy. <laughs> Handling this contraption right here with one hand is nearly impossible. But hey, let's turn it on. Let's go to auto mode. No. Video mode. Oh yes, it does focus. Let's go. Oh, there is even audio. Hello. Oh my God, this is amazing. This is absolutely something completely different, but the, the whole thing is just crazy heavy. Let's go for a recording. Whoa. So that's the thing right there. I'm at 3.2 and the microphone is pointing somewhere. Oh my God, I'm super shaky. This is so heavy. Oh, 2.8 right there. 2.2. Whoa, this is insane. Here's a comparison between two phone and Sony. Oh, I don't even know what I'm filming in. Which mode, which, like which settings. 2.8. Come on, give me the 2.0, 2.5. 2.2 Ooh. Can you see me in the background struggling? The Ronin S isn't set up correctly as well. Hey, okay, focus on the background, please. Oh my god, okay, whatever, whatever. So yeah, this is it. This is the 5.5 grand vlog setup right there. Super heavy. Oh my god, I obviously still need to solve the screen issue. This will make everything just so much better. But yeah, that's the thing right there. This setup is completely mental but it is looking so freaking awesome the quality is amazing i can't wait to test this to go for my first sony a7 vlog when this vlog will be ready you can definitely check it out right here but yeah that's enough progress for today smash that like button the way this thing smashes my my freaking arms this is unbelievably heavy so oh bang the bell like ha, ha never miss crazy equipment vlogs check the reasons on chrisviral.com and yeah that's it for today i will see you tomorrow